Here on Wall Street, it was a mixed finish for stocks yesterday. The Dow snapped its winning streak, losing 12 points, while the Nasdaq kept up its gains, rising 20. GoPro is slashing its workforce after a dismal holiday sales season. The company will let go about a fifth of its staff and eliminate its drone unit. The company CEO also plans to reduce his $800,000 salary to just a buck. Google is being sued over male discrimination. Two former engineers are accusing the company of discriminating against white conservative men, alleging Google shuns employees who deviate from the liberal agenda. One plaintiff, James Damore, was fired last year after he wrote a memo criticizing Google's diversity programs and blaming biological differences for the gender inequality in tech. Americans borrowed more money in November. U.S. consumers racked up nearly $28 billion in new debt on credit cards coupled with new auto and student loans. The Federal Reserve says consumer borrowing grew the most in more than two years. And a lawsuit is thrown out against Starbucks over too much foam. Two customers sued the Java giant saying foam shouldn't be included in the volume of a drink. A California judge rejected the claim saying it was reasonable to expect foam in a latte. And that's your CBS Money Watch report. For more, head to cbsmoneywatch.com. At the New York Stock Exchange, I'm Diane King-Hall.